Welcome back guys, and today we're gonna do some Clash of Clans. I know it's been a while since my last Clash of Clans video, but it's been like 8 months or so. But from now on I'm gonna try to do daily Clash of Clans videos along Cast Crush and Clash Rail. So you know what to expect. I believe that I even was like Tunnel 10 when I made my last Clash of Clans video. And now we are Tunnel 11 and we have done quite a bit of progress. But are we like halfway through maxing tunnel 11? We get a level 41 king and we get a level 36 queen. We also got the grand warden we get that at level 20, which is the max level for that. I know that since the first day that we got to tunnel 11, I just kept the grand warden upgrading the entire time. I've had it like for a few raids or so until it was maxed. Right, but the farming arm that I'm using right now is Lava Lunion, we got Lava Hound, we got Minions and we got the Balloons. That's kind of the standard armor that I'm using right now, and been using for a while. Let me know what kind of army that you're using for farming, and what town hall you are. And in the Clan Castle I'm usually using like Balloons for backup. Right, let's move over to our, our builder base. I'm not sure if you guys seen that. But we are build horse 6 and we are like halfway through maxing that, something like that, more or less. The current army that I'm using is Bay Dragons, that is like the only army that I actually have maxed out on the builder hall. We get a maxed out battle machine as well, the hero. But at the troop range where I'm at, it's super important to actually have those max up troops. So that's kind of why I'm just running with Babe Dragons for now. Right now I'm trying to get my minions upgraded as well. They are level 9 currently, going to level 10. So I'm gonna try to get that to level 12, which is the max level. And after that I'm probably gonna try to get the Night Witches and get them up to level 12 as well. The Night Witch, it's pretty strong. Like I've actually seen like multiple people actually like 2 star or 3 star my Builder Hall with Night Witches. Right, but guys, let's go and do some farming, we need some resources on our main base. And we need one more star to get the star bonus as well. So, let's jump into it. Alright, guys, we found a pretty good base right here. It's kind of dead, but the Infernos and the Expos, they are still alive. We got 500,000 gold and elixir, we got almost 6,000 dark elixir, so that's pretty good. So what charge did we attack from? I'm thinking like the Arch Queen side. So I'm just going to drop to to hay spells right here. I'm going to go for the lava hound and the balloons behind that, and backing that up with a few minions. This town eleven doesn't have the eagle artillery. It's pretty new one. Let's go with that. Let's go with the grand warden as well. And I'm going to use the ability probably right now, and let's freeze that. I'm going to rage that up on the left side, and let's haste as well. I guess so far it's looking pretty good for us. We get one Infern Tower, can we take out the second one too? We took out the Infern Tower, we're gonna get the two star. And I'm going to wait a bit with my heroes, and I usually don't waste like all the spells. Right, most of the balloons are out, let's go with the heroes, probably around here. Like most of the loot that's left is in the collectors. And all the collectors are here at the top lane. Right, the cannon, it's doing quite some damage to our king right there. It's like half HP right now. And it did take care of our Grand Warden, that's very unfortunate, because that's super good to have in all the raids. And I have not boosted my my barracks, or my spell factories. But we do have one army ready just after this one. I'm just going to go for the free star. And we need one more building, where is it? Can take that out easily, but we need to get that star bonus, we need one star to actually get the first one, and I believe we have the second as well. Because I haven't played in a few days. There we go, we need now three stars to actually get the second star bonus. I believe you get one like in 18 hours, or I'm not sure if you can see. Okay, we can't see like when you get that, but I believe like daily. 
So we're just going to create my second army or another army right here. We do have one ready for battles. It's going to build that up and should we go for a builder hall raid? I think so. And I just got my firecrackers upgraded to level 6. So that's probably going to be very good. You usually face like minions or bay dragons, that's very common. As well as I'm starting to see like the night witches as well. Right, we're just going to go for our babe dragons right here. Right, how should we go now? I usually make like a circle around the base. You need to be somewhat careful when you place down the babe dragons. Yes, you can get that rage ability. If you place them like two very close together, they will not have the rage ability. Let's use one more right here, back that up, one here. Let's take care of the double cannon as well. We need to make a somewhat good path for our, our battery machine. Go take that out. I believe we're gonna get like a one star on this. Let's go for the battle machine right here, let's use the belt early on. Okay, one hit and that crusher will go out. Okay, we took that up, I guess we can get the two star. Maybe it's going to be very close. Let's see. We got second ability. We got Tesla, we got the mortar and we got the arch tower. Turning the bell machine. Can we do it? Can we get the ability in time? We got the ability. We got the town hall, or we got the builder wall. That was super close, like the health of the battle machine was so little. But we did get that and we got a very high percentage 2 star, so that might be enough. Let's just watch our opponent's attack right here. And he got a 65% 2 star, and it's over. He got one bomber left and he got one archer. And we got 83%, can he beat that? The bomber that's out, he got one archer to take out what's gonna be like four buildings. Gonna get that camp for sure, and I believe the Tesla will take her out, the archer. Or, okay, there we go. The archer almost took out the Tesla. Right, but we got that win, and we got some good loot from that. The best thing with the Builder Hall is, is that you can't lose your loot on, on defense. But the thing is that you get free, you can get free wins a day and you will get a bonus from that, a win bonus. And you can only get that three times a day. But I'm just going to boost this up like that and we're going to jump back to our normal base and we're going to do a few more battles. Or I guess just yes, like one more, I don't want to make the videos too long. Right now we only have the queen, I'm just going to check out the king, how much health. We get 11 minutes on that and we get 42 minutes on the, on the Grand Warden. So we're going to have to do our raid without them, let's see what we can do. Right guys, we just found a good base to attack. There is a lot of loot in this base. But the thing is I don't think we can take care of all of it with our troops that we have right now. We don't have the Warden and we don't have the King. The eagle, it's kind of off-centered, so I guess we can take care of that pretty easily. Hey spells, let's go for the lava hound, let's go with the balloons. Gonna freeze that. We're gonna go with a few minions. Gonna go for a rage ball. I really don't like this to not have the grand warden. Let's go with the poison. A few more minions. Alright, we got a lot of balloons there in the center. Right, we took out quite a lot. Let's use one more haste spell. Let's try to take out as many defensive buildings as we can. Seems like most of the loot is actually in the collectors. And they are kind of like around the base. Let's go with a few minions right here to take out the expo. Let's use a few right here too. Because all our balloons are out right now. And I think in like this top corner right here around the queen and at the cannon and launch tower. 
I think that's where I'm going to drop our Arch Queen. So we can take care of that. We're going to get one drill. We're going to get, hopefully, three gold mines and maybe that's Collector as well. And the drop drill at the, at the enemy's queen. Okay, let's use the ability right now. Okay, we took out the cannon. Let's go for queen. Please go for the, for the collectors. Right, she's moving in. Let's use the minions right here. All right, we're gonna get a bit of elixir there with those minions. Maybe not the best trade. It would have gone a bit better with our Grand Warden and King. But we got some decent loot. We got like 300,000 golden elixir and around 3.5 thousand dark elixir. So that's a pretty good raid. And plus the loot bonus on that as well. So let's train up one more army. So we get for the next raid. I want to do it like this. I'm gonna jump over to our builder hall again. We did boost our, our clock tower. We have lost that right now. So we're gonna do one more battle with with the builder hall. Let's see what we can do. They don't have any corner buildings. I'm thinking like something like this. Two here, two here, one there. Let's use one more, we need to give it a dark tower. Come on, Dragon, take it out. There we go, we took it out, and we're gonna go like this. Right, we wasted all our dragons right now. What can we do now against, or with the battle machine? I feel like we need to drop it here at the, at the top. And hopefully we can get to the Builder Hall, I don't really think so. But at least we do have the one star. So we don't have to worry about that. Let's just use the ability as fast as we can. But I believe we're gonna lose this raid. It's not looking too good. So what he does, he's going with the archers. I believe we've got a 53% 1 star. So let's see how we do. I believe with only archers like this, he might be able to get like 60% probably on my base. Let's see if we can win this. We did hit archers with the mortar, that's pretty good. He got 8 torches left and he got the bell machine. He got 36%. It's going to be pretty close. He's definitely not going to get the 2 star. Right, the Tesla is out. The torch tower is probably going to have 2. Here comes the bell machine. And right now he got 48% in need like two more buildings. And he's going for the for the builder hall, can we take it out? No, he's going to get that. He got pretty lucky with the bell machine that turned the builder hall. But guys, he's going to win that battle. He did win it. He got 53% two star. Alright, but guys, this is it for today's video. And let me know what you think about this Clash of Clans videos. And guys, I will see you next time.